Hey everybody, today I'm going to be traveling to the big island of Hawaii and I'm going to be taking my underwater robot with me. This is the V6 Fee Fish Underwater Robot and it's a really cool robot. I'll be showing you the things it can do and we'll be seeing what we can find underwater. My goal is to find the giant manta ray. Let's see if we can do it. Now the reason I wanted to spot a giant manta ray is because they're amazing creatures. They can grow up to 24 feet long. They can weigh up to 6,600 pounds. And besides humans, they have very little predators because they can swim up to 24 kilometers an hour if they're in danger. The only way you can really get near them is if they want to. So what my goal is now is to use the bright lights of the drone to attract plankton because the manta rays eat plankton. So I want to get them to swim up to it and we can get some amazing shots of them actually swimming near the drone. Let's see if I can actually do this. So I'm gonna be taking you on my journey today with my underwater robot to see what kind of life we can find up to 300 feet underwater. This is going to be awesome. All right, let's pack it up and get on the plane. And I'd like to thank Fee Fish for sponsoring this video and sending me this amazing drone. So when we arrived on the big island, I wasn't quite sure what to expect. I had never been there before, but I was determined that I was gonna use my robot to find something awesome underwater. So it has six degrees of freedom. It can go like this, like this, like this. You can do 360 flips, 90 degree turns, pretty much anything you want. And what's really cool is wherever you stop it, it stays there. So if you turn it like this, it'll keep its uh, location there and you can point it in anything you want underwater. And also the coolest part is you can do first person view. So you can put these goggles on and you can turn your head and it follows the motion of your head underwater. So it's like you're going 300 feet underwater and scuba diving, it's awesome. And the coolest thing, it has a 4K camera on here and also these 4,000 lumen lights. So you can see anything you want deep down underwater. So before I head out to the ocean, first I check it out in a little cove near our hotel that doesn't have a lot of waves so I can test out the drone first. And look what I found just in here, it's pretty amazing. This is so cool, look at all these fish. This is my kind of snorkeling. <laughs> this is awesome. You turn the phone and it moves. So cool. Hey, this is so cool. Is it just moving around? It's moving exactly. That's cool. This is so Wait, cool. Wait, turn around and look at me. <laughs> Now I got excited here because I thought I had spotted a manta ray, but it was really an eagle ray. Still pretty cool nonetheless. Now in order to find these giant manta rays, we went to all different parts of the big island. Even some pretty inaccessible places. Now on this day we thought we spotted some dolphins, so we thought it'd be pretty cool to swim out with the dolphins. Now with our trip to Hawaii running out, we still hadn't seen the giant manta ray. Now because the giant manta ray were protected, in order to not hurt the manta ray, we decided to not use the underwater robot to film it. Instead, we headed out onto a surfboard that had a light in the middle of it, and we shined it deep down in the water and waited. And sure enough, after a while, we found them.
around four giant manta rays showed up. Now these ones were pretty big in size, probably around eight to 10 feet. It's said that in this location, there's one that's around 18 feet long, but we didn't see it on this night. But still, it was pretty cool to see them. They're amazing creatures. So in the end, we were able to find a giant manta ray and use our underwater robot to see some amazing stuff. And I'd like to thank Bee Fish again for sponsoring this video. Thanks for the drone. It was amazing to use and see what's under the water here. It's really cool technology. If you want to check it out, I'll put a link to their website in my description. And thanks again for watching another episode of the Action Lab. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, remember to hit the subscribe button and remember to hit the bell so that you can be notified when my latest videos out so you don't miss it. And head over to theactionlab.com to check out the Action Lab subscription box. And thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.